six and a bigger cool overnight at five up to 24. So the good news, plenty of sunshine on the way. The bad news, unfortunately, the garden's looking a little thirsty at the moment. Mary? Thanks, Nathan. Well, while the showers were scarce, the raincoats were plentiful when the Wollongong Whales issued the raincoat challenge. Take your mark, go! And with that, the inaugural raincoat challenge swam into action. The unusual event hosted by the Wollongong Whales is used as the club's annual fundraiser for charity. The continental pool was awash with yellows, greens and blues as our dedicated swimmers put their raincoats through the ultimate waterproof test. By the looks of most of these hardened athletes, none of their raincoats offered any protection from the elements. And some just simply didn't want to be a part of the test. Legend has it the weird idea to race in raincoats was spawned from a mishap involving club captain Ray Vickers who was washed into the pool during a wet stormy day as he attempted to pull in the lane ropes from the pool. Much to his embarrassment, he had to be rescued by his fellow clubbies. Iron man Jonathan Crow, always keen for a challenge, was the last swimmer in his team's relay and won the tightly contested event. On behalf of the Wales, congratulations. Good on you, Joy. Well done, Luke. You've done that again. Yeah. The Wales raised more than $200 in the swim for the Wollongong Hospital yeah, Children's Ward. Rod Maley, Win News. Nice trophy too. That's our bulletin for this Monday evening. Until tomorrow, good night.